The London Aquatics Centre is an indoor facility with two 50-metre swimming pools and a 25-metre diving pool in Queen Elizabeth Olympic Park in Stratford, London. The centre, one of the main venues of the 2012 Summer Olympics and the 2012 Summer Paralympics, was used for the swimming, diving and synchronised swimming events. After significant modification, the centre opened to the public in March 2014. Design The center was designed by Pritzker Prize-winning architect Zaha Hadid in 2004 before London won the bid for the 2012 Summer Olympics. It was built alongside the water polo arena and opposite the Olympic Stadium on the opposite bank of the Waterworks River. The site is 45 meters, 148 feet high, 160 meters, 520 feet long, and 80 meters, 260 feet wide. The wave-like roof is stated to be 11,200 square feet, 1,040 square meters, a reduction from the previously stated 35,000 square feet, 3,300 square meters. The design was inspired by the Dolan Aqua Centre in East Kilbride, Scotland. The complex has a 50m competition pool, a 25m competition diving pool, and a 50m warm up pool. The 50m pool is 3 metres deep, like the one in the Beijing National Aquatics Centre, in order to be fast. Its floor can be moved to reduce its depth. There are also movable booms that allow its size to be changed. The diving pool has platform boards at heights of 3 meters, 5 meters, 7.5 meters, and 10 meters and 3 3 meters springboards. For the television coverage of the Olympics, the pools were also equipped with innovative cameras in order to present the action from multiple angles. Because the center was designed before the Olympic bid was completed, the spectator wings were not part of the original design. They were later added to fit the estimated audience. Jacques Rog, IOC president, described the centre as a «masterpiece». Topic construction On 1 December 2005, Hadid was instructed to revise her designs after a specification change led to a doubling of the £75 million estimated cost. The new plans were unveiled on 27 November 2006. Although the same general design was kept, with capacity for 17,500 spectators, the revised design was much smaller and was expected to cost much less than the previous estimate. However, subsequent cost increases were reported to Parliament in 2008. The construction contract was awarded to Balfour Beatty in April 2008. At the same time, it was reported that the centre would cost about three times as much as originally estimated, totalling about £242 million. The cost increases were attributed to construction inflation and VAT increases, and also included the estimated cost of converting the facility for public use after the Olympic and Paralympic Games. The center was completed in July 2011 at a final cost of 269 million pounds by exposing the concrete finish rather than painting or cladding. The design demonstrates the precast concrete skills provided by Perry. The precast floor terracing was manufactured by Bell and Webster Concrete in Lincolnshire, England. The terracing units were delivered and positioned to accelerate the speed of construction. The unique six-board diving platform is made from 462 tons of concrete. The aluminium roof covering was provided by Calzip. The steel structure was built in cooperation with Roaccord Engineering, of Newport, Wales. The ceiling was built with 30,000 sections of red loro timber. The steel roof weighs 3,200 tons. The three pools hold around 10 million liters, 2.2 million imperial gallons, 2.6 million US gallons of water. After the Paralympic Games, the aquatic center was deconstructed to reduce its space. The frame wings on either side of the central space were removed, unbolted, and sold. The PVC wrap that temporarily enclosed the space was also sold, while the seats and toilets were reused elsewhere. As certain parts of the building were no longer needed, they were recycled via vinyl loop. This allowed the standards of the Olympic Delivery Authority concerning environmental protection to be met. Topic: <coughs> <coughs> Capacity. 
During the games the venue had a capacity of 17,500. The two temporary «wings» have been removed, reducing the capacity to a regular 2,800 with an additional 1,000 seats available for major events. Of all the swimming venues built for the 2012 Summer Olympics, the Aquatics Center is the only one that will remain afterwards, albeit in a downsized form. Legacy Since the Olympic Games the venue has been modified, especially by removing the temporary seating that flanked the center during the Games. It opened to the public on 1 March 2014. Admission prices are in line with local leisure centers. The adjacent water polo arena was dismantled after the Olympic Games, which left the Aquatics Center as the sole swimming venue at the park. The center hosted the 2014 FINA, NVC Diving World Series and the 2016 European Aquatics Championships. Comparable venues in England Crystal Palace National Sports Centre, London Ponds Forge, Sheffield John Charles Centre for Sport, Leeds Manchester Aquatics Centre Sunderland Aquatic Centre